we had a customer who'd asked us to design their supply chain for them and we were using the approach that we, we've always used and, and I remember halfway through the meeting um, Mike said stop we're going to have to do this different. He said let's forget about the inbound, let's forget about the inventory, let's concentrate on the demand. So we had that business requirement of, of doing something differently um, and Aris saw that there was an academic opportunity to research this question of how does a logistics company forecast inventory and help customers reduce inventory. Traditional third-party logistics providers that have been focusing on filling warehouses uh, uh, with, with inventory, which uh, if we think about it is the exact opposite of what customers need. So beyond the actual automated solution that we have created here, essentially I think that the most innovative aspect is the introduction of a new business model, one that helps uh, 3PL companies to help their customers keep less inventories and essentially uh, manage complex global supply chains based on, on, on speed and asset velocity. The tool, it is called D-squared ID, Demand Driven Inventory Dispositioning, and it helps customers improve speed and asset velocity, and also it helps customers reduce their inventory levels, free up cash and improve their service levels. Well, the backbone of the solution uh, relies upon statistical mathematical principles. Essentially, we try to optimize the situation, minimize the cost, uh, subject to always satisfying demand. Uh, if you think about it, uh, a large organization they may hold, let's say, 1,000 different stockkeeping units or sometimes up to 100,000 different products. So, essentially, there is a massive investment here on inventory uh, and it follows that very small improvements here uh, they may translate to substantial benefits, money that otherwise would be tied up in stock and now can be released back into the economy. The end result is very easy to use. Uh, it's a simple interface, just by clicking some buttons, uh, the people that they use that can easily optimize their inventories without necessarily having to know that much about what is happening on the back of the solution. So from a pure commercial perspective, this gives us something that stands out because we know that no other company does it now and we know how difficult it was for us to do it. So it's going to take them at least two, maybe even three years to catch up and do what we did. 